Well, howdy there. This is the Rockin' J Farrier. I'm here to do a maintenance hoof trim on these two horses. The one of them, the Palomino, was worked on here a couple months ago. She had some really bad cracks in her front feet, and he had the vet come over. I worked with the vet, and she dremeled, dremeled the cracks all out and got them all cleaned out and then I put some stra some uh, strap hinges over the cracks to hold her feet together so today we're going to be checking them out and doing a little maintenance. Well we got the old Palomino caught. <clears throat> things did lighting might be a little trouble cave okay, came in there and ground this out and that foot has grown down from there clear down so gotta move those clean that up a little and move those hinges up so let's see how this goes gotta put this bit in and just smooth this off just a little. there a little bit and that looks like that's really holding together doing really good I'm gonna have to get her trimmed up a little and move that up there and this mare has a tendency to want to to want to hang back on a rope to set back on it so she's not one that you want to be tying up and getting all throwing her foot up everybody wants to put them up on a stand well this this mare the only reason she did it when we originally put this together was because she she had a whole shot of meds in her and I don't have the vet here to do that so we're so that hinge there is keeping that together so it's trying to grow grow that crack out Alright, as you can see, or maybe you can't get that light on there. I was able to move that hinge from those holes right there up to there. So move that hinge up. Now it'll hold that hold that crack 
so it'll start growing together and growing new growing some new hoof wool and keep it growing together so now I gotta trim that foot hi there Pally you were a good girl huh yeah you've been a good girl huh and they got this horse when she was a baby and that's what they call her his baby so when I'm out working them I can't call them anything than what they've been called well sometimes you call them a few things but try not to call them too many different names okay dude let's just see if we can trim this up a little she doesn't like like this so I gotta watch her he tends to want to pull back I'm gonna want to thin this wall out because she's kind of flaring out. So I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna kind of rock her this toe a little. And I'm pulling it clear back to the white line. So that she'll break over. She wants that break over not too much in front of the apex of the frog right there. So we're about there on that. And I don't want this wide foot pulling that hoof apart. So it'll split it at the bottom. Now I've got it rockered over so that, that foot is it's kind of breaking, it's breaking over so it won't put pressure and split that and split that foot out so I got that trim so it's gonna stop that stop that flare and hold that together what do you say baby? huh? Give her another little taste of feed to keep her occupied for a minute. been a little more than two months it's like she's grown quite a little foot which is which is good roll that edge just a little I use my nippers because that's easier than rasping and 
and they just feel a little smoother with the rasp. And we're good to go. Hey dear. She walks on the outside of this foot. I want to trim the inside flush with that hoof and sole the hoof. And I'm going to skinny out here and leave just a little bit of hoof one on the outside. And that frog wants to flop to the inside, which is is what's pushing that foot out that way. I want to make sure I get that out of there. And I'll take the flare off to the inside. And then just just barely enough to bevel the outside. Carbide here. Like we got pretty good drill up here on top. that screwed back down there and those screws are just long enough that they go through the hook but not into the laminate into where she sensed it now you can see how I've got that moved up from these holes right here up into here and now you can see that other foot I got it rockered over squared off where it'll break over and now I gotta trim this one and do the same with it really if you throw it around it'll magically fill up with grain is that how it works huh probably is huh oh yeah he wants some too your buddy wants some too. We'll let you, I'll let you chase that around a little. How about that? Save some for your buddy. Okay, dear. Now we get on this side. This is a place you can't see. Yeah, see she gets 
a little bit ignorant on that front. Wants to wander around. So I'm gonna bring this back. It's all flared out, so I'm bringing it back to that white line. So she had enough for a second. Okay, dear. Hey. got that where she's breaking over and that'll take the pressure off of that got that hinge moved up got her breaking over on both feet so that she can keep growing that crack together well there we are that little job done so until next time Keep one ear to the ground and your eyeballs peeled and just remember, don't believe everything you hear and only half of what you see. We'll catch you down the trail.